Look here, let me get right to the point. Let me not take up too much of y'all time. Let me get right to the point. I haven't done one of these in a long time. So what better time than now? With that being said, let me tell you the real reason why Danny Garcia fought Earl Spence. The real reason why Danny Garcia fought Earl Spence was because it was this. It was for them M's. It wasn't for them straps. It wasn't to tell people, to show people that he was the better fighter. He fought for them for that for that check. He knew goddamn well he couldn't compete with no Earl Spence. For one, Danny Garcia is too straight up and down, too flat-footed, and he go, he's always on the retreat. He waits for a guy, um, and Earl Spence is not a stationary fighter for you to be able to get off your shots like that. Danny knew exactly what he was doing. I don't knock him for, for, for getting his bag, but you couldn't compete. And all that that his father was talking through, um, you know, whole time leading up to the fight, that was all to sell a fight to get a check. He knew he couldn't compete. And this was la this was Danny's last chance at a big payday. With that being said, congrats to Earl. Danny Garcia, man, don't don't try that again. You had I don't know who he thought he convinced with uh thinking that he was gonna be the better fighter and he was gonna do this, he was gonna do that. Danny knew how to sell. Uh, sell that pitch to get that bag. With that being said, I'm your boy, Miss AJ Double. It's been a long time since I did one of these again, but I yell at you. I'm out. Gone.